Lux. I'm the most brutal and vicious and most ruthless champion there's ever been. There's no one can stop me. Lynx is a conqueror. No, I'm Alexander. He's no Alexander. I'm the best ever. There's never been anybody as ruthless. I'm Sonny Listen. I'm Jack Dempsey. There's no one like me. I'm from their claw. There's no one that can match me. My style is impetuous. My defense is impregnable. And I'm just ferocious. I want your heart. I want to eat his children. I'm the most brutal and vicious and most ruthless champion there's ever been. Never trust the living. Hola, familia. <laughs> happy days. Happy day. Happy days on podcast. It's a happy day to have a good day. Okay, yeah. happy days on podcast is right here. As always, we've got legends. Kaje Nurnali, the one and only Ndate Kapa Brasil Lomake Kanyube, who is going to be joining us today. Ndate Kapa Brasil Lomake. Ndate Kapa Brasil Lomake. Ndate <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Okay, heavy days on podcast. Check out the interview following shortly. As I said, the one and only Brasillo Marke Kanube. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Hey, San Monani. Hey, this is Fisher Matambo again. Ah, now I'm solo. Hey, I wanna get this cut to end scene and cut. I'm gonna be solo, man. Hey, but keep it in a station, man. To go on, keep it chill by me seven zin. Hey, it could look it rain. Cool. In general, I panna, but it say Murafu was tell. Ah, but I'm gonna make time to try for my trust. Jesus, I bet this car man is just as mad as Paulo Kesa Chiefs. Hey, I want to buy no hey. station <laughs> But This is Peter Matambo Oh, next time on this weekend. It's a happy days on a podcast. Yeah, you know, it's always a, a happy day to have a good day. And we beg for more. And I'm telling you, uh, that this episode is a very special one. Mm -hmm. We are having someone who's very close to, um, I mean, you know, I've been following and tracking him. I mean, mm -hmm. Namun Kulek Benimbukil TV is keep. So <laughs> I'm very happy to actually introduce, yeah, one of the legends, the legendary. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Silo, uh, I call you uh, Dasilo. Yeah, yeah. Eta Regis. Uh, and thank you so much for honoring uh, the invitation. I know. Yeah, yeah, I know. Bro. Thank you so much. And then tell me, Dasilo, mm -hmm. why, how are you uh, maintaining your health and uh, the, the, the young looking that you always, um, you know, give us? Because <laughs> you, you don't change. You always Regi, look like Regi, that. You know, you know. You know so you, how do you maintain it? Regi, the secret. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure there's a secret. Regi, there. bro, you yeah. should ask my knees. <laughs> 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 they tell you a better story. Okay. Okay. How, how no, do you do uh, it? There's no help. <laughs> oh, they, oh, there's no help. Then. Oh, they, they, miss, they miss when you age, my bro. Okay. When you age, yeah. uh, the knees are the, uh, the first ones to let you know. Relax. I mean, I thought something, something that is in the family. Nah. That you nah, guys nah, are no. aging nicely. Yeah. From the mother or the father. Yeah. Nah, not really. I mean, you know, uh, well, you know, you never. 
Well, Itamala, you know, I'm actually trying to think of Itamala. Itamala, mm. I mean, though I mean, you know, he died at, um, at at an early age, at 55. Oh, geez. You know, so I've lived a little longer than him. Yeah, yeah. I remember when, so when, 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 when 55, you know, hit me. Yeah. I was yeah. like, hey, so we know you just married the young wife. <laughs> but the way you look in, I know. I, I, you know? I, mean, I thought it's uh, more of uh, the healthy living that you yeah. actually uh, because I read somewhere yeah. that you, you're living a healthy life and thanks to Six Pell, yeah. by the way. You know, mm, yeah. I know she cooks healthy. <laughs> you know, yeah. healthy. That's it. That was a grand. No. Because they say um, mm. a healthy living is uh, uh, cost uh, prohibitive. But mm-hmm, uh, when mm-hmm. you're looking at it broadly, though, yeah. you will see that um, healthy living, uh, um, it might be costly, but yeah. uh, at least the cost, yeah, health, than the cost of going to hospital, you know, because that, those are more costly. No, in fact, they, well, what did they say? There's a lovely, there's a lovely thing saying, man. I'm trying to think of it. Hore, mm. um, in fact, barking, you are what you eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, 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 you know what I mean? So basically, I mean, if you eat, you know, barking junk food and whatever. become junk. And I mean, you can climb with Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the time, you say, you you say, you say, you say, you say, you you yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, you know, um, so I mean, like living. basically, I think, you know, it's, I think not even healthy living. I mean, it's actually just doing everything in moderate, yeah, in moderation. Yeah, yeah. You know? Because I heard there's a story mm. of somewhere, uh, there's an island in Japan yeah. where people actually live for more than 100 years there no. because of the way they, 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 they not live, to, because mm. they, they always exercise. In fact, uh, apparently when you when you reach 100 years, they, mm-hmm. there's even a, a certificate for no. that, you know. Yeah, 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 as well, government officials hey, yeah. go far route. Hey, now you're 100, my brother. Hey, see that, my brother. Exactly. My, my wife, my sweet wife, hundred. I think my wife would be. Happy. You know, my wife would be happy. Yeah, you know, yeah, if yeah. I, if, I mean, when I'm sixty. Yeah. So, so how many years? Thirty. Thirty-seven. Ah, yeah, no, 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 sixty-three. Well, in Bamba, sixty-three this so year. So thirty-seven. Yeah. So, um, yeah. It's, uh, so if I can live for another thirty-seven. I think it will be even more. Shy than hundred. That. No, I think it will want, be more. Yeah, one shy hundred. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And so I want to food. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So when I mention, you can imagine. Yeah. Who cap me? No, we get pension. Who get sas? Yeah. So he's a twenty chance. I see. I'm going to get a chance. You know, if I live another. 20, yeah. ah, you cap and I need to pay me was a simple collect, <laughs> <laughs> you know, see you, you know, so and then from there we'll live another, and then if ever, hey man, I'm trying to make sense of this, my brother, yeah. allow me, <laughs> allow me, you know, you so, all the time. so basically, uh, okay, we are one year married, mm. so if I live for another 37, yeah, now I'm going to be working. How many years? 39 at least. <laughs> at least when I will post like other people, you know, who say, <laughs> I've been married for 20 years. years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everyone needs that. How long have you been married? Yeah. 14 years. Yeah, 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 Especially for my guys that brag about it. You know, I'm going to meet him, I'm You know, you know. I'm not advising you to just keep on. 14 years, going by. 14 years. No, but it would be, I think, I think it would be great. Yeah, I don't know. It would be great. And I guess so, maybe, maybe that, maybe whereas I'm heading that direction, I'm going to have to make sure I nah, now I have to live a healthy life. Yeah. You know? <laughs> I must go to that island. Yes, yes no, you need to go to that Love, island. Love, we are going to go to that <laughs> island. <laughs> And I want to talk more you know, about after it. after after my, my muscle collect my, yeah, when yeah, she collects yeah, yeah, yeah. I know this is pension so my bill <laughs> so let's go <laughs> yeah. and spend the rest of our years <laughs> so that I hit hundred hit hundred you know yeah. when I hit hundred yeah when you are hitting eighty. <laughs> <laughs> 
So it's for to gap. And then and then, and then you know for this just be inspired more. Yeah. You know what I mean? Give us away not over only 80. Then I need 120. Some touch you okay more than back more. But see, but yeah, it's all this couple. I know, you know, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, but it's a good mm-hmm. thing. It's really nice to have you. No, know, health, health, I mean good health is is, is important. Yeah, it is. it is. You know, and I think even like now I'm actually even more cautious. I mean, I used to be, you know, very cautious, you know, even when I was young. Okay. You know, you know, I mean, yeah, we had so shy sparada but but in no way, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. And also I mean I've always dabbled with uh, you know, going vegetarian, mm, 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 you know, mm, mm, and I you know, I've I've treated myself very well. I've looked I'll, after myself. And I also want to talk more about this is hell now. Yeah. Uh, about about how you guys started you know just with yeah. each other but for now i yeah. just want to maybe track and look at e- e valentine's month yeah, uh, yeah. E- valentine's month um what's your advice to emergency you go valentine you go with valentine's month nya kabangu to spell yeah aga lali ngingelona nge t-shirt yaka siri ramaphosa eh uma chance no call with the media ama yang khathaz mang ithi mbonu ilale mang ithi mbonu ukulona u ramaphosa u ramaphosa mang ithi zawo ngothu tempeting No, but you, you know I think sometimes mm. you know I don't know I just think we but in we take things I mean we talk about things in such a way that as if we make them too serious so uh, not, not even too serious mm. you know we make them I think what happens in your bedroom or yeah. in whatever it's something that you should preserve for yeah, yeah it's a special and, and and if there's anything if mm, mm. a problem na leon to leo na so chela wena ukuthi ne ebiki yalala ila you know but i mean among la 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 hi no ramaphosa or 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 no suje exactly you know what i mean but i mean it it is cause in the media yeah 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 okay you know Yeah. You know, but sometimes, but, but sometimes, um, that when they learn, ah, yeah, when they learn, we think, "Can we come to learn?" My dear, come to learn. We are the figures. We are the figures. Because me, and um, just talk about uh, me now. What I do, mm-hmm. uh, me now every day is Valentine. Yeah, I just take it in that fashion because yeah. I think uh, for me and, and most guys, mm-hmm. Valentine has been overrated in terms of uh, money making. You know, that's it. Yeah, is, you know. So I just told my my my, my girlfriend now who it's okay, right? Yeah. Okay, we're going to go to business right now. Yeah, on business. Yeah, we're yeah, okay. Even in Valentine, even Valentine, my baby. Every I'll, day. I'll give you. A, but but the unfor- unfortunate part. Yeah. Uh, the very uh, Valentine's month. It's yeah. Her birthday. You know? oh, okay. Yeah, All that's, right. That's just a set no, but I think also. I mean, <laughs> you know, you know, this is how I used to get out of this thing. Yeah. yeah Valentine. <laughs> you know and you know when the girl you know when i meet a girl and i would like and said you know what baby there's something that you got to be careful of yeah um when i'm an actor so I'm going to be discreet <laughs> because I'll act the part. I'll act the part, <laughs> you know. So if you tell me or no, got the 14, you want yeah. me to love you. Yeah. You know what I mean? So you must know. I, I will I will act it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know. Oh, so okay. you would not yeah. know whether it should be natural. It's, it, whether it's me or me okay. act. Ngoba ungitshelile ukuthi no, hit that mark. Or in acting. So it's better keep it in, natural. Exactly. In 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 acting they always say hit your mark look the other person in the <laughs> eye and tell the truth okay. you know what i mean so i know how to fake the truth <laughs> <laughs> so it's best to do that you know what i mean be natural exactly. and be yourself and besides e14 ilanga lika le out le over valentine So, Angi yaz no go yaz na. So why falling celebrating in the park? Why falling celebrating? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I love you. So me na said no even the media me get no the media get hey my begala. Our Valentine mm. it is the day we go together. Yeah. That's our Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> Because nini nini utatu utenga eh i couple ne message enga balonga u. You you know so what I mean? I don't even think you actually mean what you present exactly so you know i mean you I, I you rather just write it you know. mm-hmm. and basically i mean if it is the day that you have marked and that you know mm-hmm. or know mm-hmm. this is the day that i met my mm-hmm. woman mm-hmm. it has meaning yeah it has meaning 
the 14th of February doesn't so, have meaning yeah, yeah, to me. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you know. So basically, our Valentine's month yeah. is actually the month that we met in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. You know you what I mean? In, uh, it's just Maybe we should begin God, to make like sense of that. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. But um, women they don't they don't uh, forget easily. No, then, but but even us, I mean, even with guys, I mean, you know, I mean, we you always remember what the chair was saying, and I hope. Kanjan, yeah, yeah. And no, we 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Guys, mm. I'm sure you must have heard then Good Valentine. Yeah. It's just a special day. And keep your bedroom uh, news or your bedroom situation no, but also, in your bedroom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, but also, you know, like I think basically like sometimes love or Lindo Lake celebrator in love and all that. Mm. Basically, it should be your daily bread. Mm. You know what I mean? Um, and and uh, it, it has to do with how you as a guy basically approach your life. Yeah. You know, there's a yeah. there's a lovely um, analogy or anecdote that I like telling. Mm. And this anecdote is about a, a carpenter, okay. you know, working in a, you know, in his workshop and yeah. he's got his seven-year-old boy. Mm. And as he's working, you know, the seven-year-old boy is like, Papa, what is this? Mm. Papa, mm. Mm. Papa, you know, and he's, yeah. you know, and he's distracting the old man from working. Mm. Now, in order to deal with the with the young boy, the father looks around in the workshop and on the wall he sees the map of the world. Okay. You know, he tears it off the wall, tears it into pieces, throws it on the floor, gets mm. cello tape, uh, gives the boy say, "Put this map together." together. You yeah. know, and that takes the boy away. You know, okay. you know, the, you know <laughs> focus. You know, and yeah, it distracts yeah. him. And the old man continues working. And after a while, after the boy has, you know, put the pieces together yeah. and all that. Then, you know, he comes back to the father and says, Hey, Papa Born. This is it, yeah. You know, I've put it together, mm -hmm. you know. Now, behind the map of the world okay. is a drawing of a man's head. Oh, yeah. You know, and the moral of the story is, if man can get his head together, yeah. the world would be a better place. To okay. Be. Okay. You see what I mean? So, I'm level headed. As a man, for now, I think I'm a biggest responsibility mm -hmm. as men is that we've got to be level-headed. You can't just say I'm a head no, of the family without you know, even just like showing it. <clears throat> exactly. Yeah. And a little love, you know, they say love is caring mm -hmm. in action mm -hmm. and love mm -hmm. is a doing word. Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. Now, let's look at how, for instance, you've got things that you love mm -hmm. and maybe let's say, you know, you love your car. You know, I mean, more than you carry out, you know, us we go geese and we go, yeah, 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 you know, we, you know, good, you know, to shag among mud flaps, la van, we drop a man, we share my locus, I call no tea, my lights, what you know, shine to the boy, he sound the seat, he clean the lapang of man, it move well, or come over to it. We don't do that. We shang a matrimony, so corner, and old man, I hope. You see what I mean? Now here's the thing that is so you know to take that thing. That way, when yeah. you love something, and you know, no more we we get. In fact, I'm not about tandy motors up. Mm, mm, they don't even allow another person to wash it. Yeah, yeah. yeah you know, about yeah, easy car yeah. wash. Yeah. Exactly. We enjoy shakes. Yeah, yeah. We have yeah. bono sounds and stuff. Yes, yeah. sound yeah. exactly. Shake <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Mm. But now. And you see with Utanda Lekar, the way he takes care yeah, of it. Yeah. So that is why love is caring yeah. in action. Now, Ibona contrary, action would you care? Yeah, but contrary to Abantu, Abona, Basukumeza, Abandes Fazan, Ubona Muntu, Makelwan, Jalonja, Uzwanje, Kukalis Maya Maya, and next door, you even actually call the cops. That's you it. Know, yeah, you, you say, I'm um, no, I, this is. Um, I'm intervening. But let's let, let's as as I think I begin at Vunalab. Let's continue a little bit. Okay. Ne? Okay. Now, when I let go, I quit. We are not. You know, 
le situation we be ka mhla be la phana be le ikare ma uthu ya istata iPhone I phone you know what i mean Come on, come on, baby. Come on, come on. Come on. Let's see. Ex- you know, if you can come to the look, you can come to You can come to the car. You can come to the car. You used to drive the XR6. Yeah. He fought XR6. You can come to the car. Amen. You see, and here's another, well, I don't know but why you look at that. You know, you can come to the car. You can come to the Is it because you're a Kibela? Yeah. Yeah. You know, but my my car is not full. Good week, man. I wish I. Actually, what you are going to do? We are poor. We are we are in Nanga. We are in Amnanya. We are full of mechanics. Yeah, good. I was a mumu. Oh, exactly. Yeah. Would somebody must be keeping you? Yeah. Was keeping you good in Caribbean crane. Yeah. So if ever going to problem in Lin. Yeah. And in me, I'm jumping in a malokoza. Why am I keeping you? We go say go go psychology. Yeah, yeah, in Subono. We are born as a glung selumu to a marriage council. We are born in present relationship expect. Exactly, bro. That's true. You know what I mean? That's true. So I mean, you know, like Lento and us, I pega. You know, you know, he he lokoza, he abuse and all that. At the end of the day, what needs to happen, men, vana, like me, should if men can get his head together. You know, mm-hmm. the world would be a better place to, yes, to be. True. And then now, here's another thing: stand we as a rich man. O tolo guti, o si stand we ish. O guti eh, he min tro go ya lo. Yeah. I am the head of yeah. this household. Yeah. 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 Now, let's look what physiologically what the, the head, head has. has. Yeah, it's got the eyes. I got the eyes so yeah. that. Vision. Yeah, yeah. So which means more windowed. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 is it? Is it? Yeah, don't yeah. And, and, uh, I mean, have not done. Oh, but you are not telling. In the wrong safety. Exact yeah. safety. Yeah. 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 Yes. It's the same thing. The same thing. Ziala lela to get I'm information, against, but point. also they actually listen to danger. Mm. You know the amazing thing I used to watch uh, my grandson uh you know monga shyand a sudden noise what a pa yeah so yeah. some way somehow am in the bezizwa lento lento ukuthi it's it's cause yeah, a, a yeah, disruption yeah, or yeah, an, yeah, an imbalance yeah. mm. and then what do we find again on the head the nose the nose the nose breathes oxygen okay. In the body, it keeps the body alive, okay. and then also, what do we find? Yeah, you the feed, mouth. You feed the the mouth. Yeah, the mouth is used to communicate. Okay. The mouth is used to feed yeah. the body. Yeah. yeah, and then there is this six gram gray matter inside the skull. Mm, 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 mm. You know, the brain. the brain, and everything the on yeah. it of the body, how it fun- it should function. Mm. It's connected there. there. As I'm doing this hands, there's a whole computer working in Zagalaila. Angel would know now the connector last year. You know mm. what I mean? So which means now, Moba, I mean look at the other thing. Mm. You will have a heart transplant. Go be a kidney transplant, be a ma transplant. Even well, you know, go be an artificial yeah, head. Yeah. But have you ever heard of an artificial head? Yeah. <laughs> have you ever heard of a head transplant? No, no. No, but once this is gone, yeah, once this is yeah, damaged, yeah, yeah. it is Everything done. Everything is done. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So if ever now we're saying we are the heads of our household, mm. do we realize what responsibility we have? Yeah. Please. and we have to make sure that if ever we are going to call ourselves the heads of our household let's look at what the job mm. of the head is mm. on the body mm. the head is basically taking care of the mm. body but i don't know how to do how to ask your spins you know it look up tell it look it you know what i mean and maulo pose 
your whole system is at work. Mm-hmm. Messages mm-hmm. are sent mm-hmm. to the Lokuzan. Mm-hmm. You know, and uh available now messages are being sent because more pushes barara is mm. barara is not good for the body yes the body is always trying to get rid of they the, the, the alcohol exactly yeah. and my my look you look at my kidneys up is a trainer the alcohol yeah. when we are dead you, you know and my kidneys are just name man hey man out of the room 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 out Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? So there's something wrong. So now your body is it's overwhelmed. Yeah. I'm a kidney is up with I'm a kidney send a person the message. I tell him good day, man. I went along to a I stop it. I stop it, I think. <laughs> 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 exactly. <laughs> you passed out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know I mean? So and now you see how the whole coordination works. Mm. You know, and because the kidneys have sent the message good yeah. no. Yeah. It's mm, mm. And the body is intelligent, my bro. But these does it these fundamental elements mm-hmm. I think they need to be also instilled. to our Absolutely. young ones i'm talking about the a boy child Absolutely, you know, man. I'm not too sure how it's done in terms of uh, the social uh, development. Mm-hmm. You know, I don't not too sure good how uh, in schools uh, things mm-hmm. are, are being done now. But I remember the time is funda. The woman is cut up mm-hmm. in a, in a life or that's a life exactly. You know, but you see, like when I manage, when I manage, I mean, we can't wait even to try and go there mm-hmm. because manage, when I go change, basically, I mean, my generation. Many of us, so kule uti vele uto lugu jai slash is shine bam. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean. Yeah. And besides, yeah. with my generation, mentality is yeah, like Yes, machine. you know yeah. exactly. Mm. But it's not the mentality we need to look in, guys. Mm. You know, mm. and and, and we got to into it. I think this is just a male and female issue. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because even even you know I've been long now way, from way back. from way back yeah, the attitude towards women yeah. has always been you know of demeaning uh, mm. the, the the you know women and all that mm. and men have all, and it's all about the insecurity mm. that men have when i hold um, conversation with men about you know issues the uh, mm. gpv i always ask one question you know and be, when i start my conversation recently mm. i would ask them said ikoni ndotala is there a man in here who is not scared ukhlelo mm. mm. there is no man who's not scared of being of his wife cheating on him yeah it's always uh, that like and that factor. exactly <laughs> and uh, that moi pega ga ning it is one of the major triggers mm. the gender based violence yeah that's true men's insecurity mm. and we have to understand what but this insecurity ipuma mm. gope you know mm. and uh, you find with men we are insecure like this but also but we normalize the problem we normalize it now when we doing it mm-hmm. no but here's another <laughs> eh and it's now what happens with you know when we become insecure or oh, but in we don't want to go to some be so hello but it's so bana that's the thing <laughs> so isn't this wrong? Is wrong when they are done by when us. they are done by so us when it suit us when it suit us <laughs> you society. know what i mean so and then we we got to look at Just this whole thing them. yeah mm-hmm. we got to look at this whole thing or never but why is that mm-hmm. and but again if you take even that further mm-hmm. you go and you get you cheat on your wife mm-hmm. you know why are you so scared or would you know <laughs> We were in a media group. And it, again, it's the insecurity part. Mm. Oh, good, what if that guy Eesh. is well endowed? <laughs> More than... <laughs> 
Exactly. You know what I mean. <laughs> so it is that old music. And, the, 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 and the, now you've got to understand, Hori, there are certain yeah, things. I know. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, you've got to realize, Hori, there are certain things that you are in control of. And mm. the thing that you can... Uh, the, thing that you can be in control of mm. is yourself. Mm. Indeed. You can never be in control of another person. And you can never even control another person. Mm. Mm. job, ni duty. And that me. even denies you for your own growth. Yeah, that's true. And you can never again be responsible for the actions of another, of person. another person. My son, uh, I had a son who passed on. Okay. Um, in a, in a car accident, what, in 2011. Mm. We had a conversation, and at 19, um, my daughter tells me, well, hey, daddy, you know that um, um, Colise, mm. you know, my son, he has mm. got four girlfriends. Yeah. You know, and that time I've got four mm. kids, yeah. you know, and with four different women. Okay. And I realized, well, yeah. as they say, the apple doesn't fall far yeah, from no, the tree. Not, yeah. But I started, excuse me, I started having a conversation with him mm. at that time. Okay. I busy out him with you, out him with the water and the food. Oh, yes, no. He saw that. Oh, yes, no. Oh, yes, no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> but I handled the whole conversation showing him. Nati, you know, when I was dating your mother, I was not doing his end. Mm. When I dated your sister's mother, I was not doing his end. Mm. When I dated your other your brother's mother, not the being his other brother's mother dying to bring his hand. Mm -hmm. but, but here's one thing that they don't tell you with this kind of behavior, to look to Cholala Pen or Cholala Pen, yeah. is that this kind of behavior is addictive. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. The sex itself mm -hmm. is addictive. Mm -hmm. You know? And then missing the music question, no one. Mm -hmm. And which is what I wanted now, mm. when he was 13, okay. you know. And it was because when I was 13, that's when I actually had some kind of identity crisis now. Yes, yes, and I thought, yes. hey, maybe that is the best time which he, I should consolidate my relationship with him. With him yeah. But anyway, he came and, you know, at 13. So I'm using it now. When you were growing up, mm. didn't you wish that I was there all the time? Mm. Tears welled up in his eyes. Mm. I can go and buy. Enga phone kuliso. Yeah. Uba wa wa. Yeah. And both parents. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm. And that you see, and I thought, oh, I was being better than my father who never raised. So me. you were absent actually. I was absent, even mm. though I was present, but at a distance. At a distance. And yeah. that is another thing we told you to see. Tabang emas majita. And then we actually go, we make babies, and we leave them. Mm. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. And that is a big problem. Yeah, and, so the thing, and, and the thing is, you know, it says something about Tina Majid. Mm. Mm. Because if ever you go and expose your sperm mm. to somebody you're somebody. not prepared mm. to spend your life with, what does it say about you? Mm. But one will say, mm -hmm. someone might come and say, hey, circumstances, you know, we're not say, living in but, an but, ideal but, but, but again, it, what does it say about you? Yeah, yeah, that's true. It, it, you know, at, at the end of the day, you are not this, I mean, nobody forced you into that situation. Yes, 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 yes. So it means we really have got to start thinking very carefully Before about our actions. Yeah. And um, the thing is, is going to have to start with how we even raise our boys. Mm. But in order to be able to raise them differently, you have got the one who is raising the child be doing some serious yeah. introspection, yeah. you know, yeah. so that you change your name. I know I grew up this way, but this is not yeah, what... This is, yeah. And uh, the thing about it is, is one, if you educate your son, mm. you are actually educating your grandchildren. Yes, yes. Because he is going to take those lessons yeah. to his children. Mm. And uh, Bruno, our, our parents, never gave us those lessons. Mm. So we are the brain working the, 
societal and brain damage mm. of our own of parents. Our own but the thing is, we have we the response. Exactly. But the thing is, mm. and once mm. you can actually begin to make decisions for yourself, mm. then you start have to, you can now you need change. change. Yeah. 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 You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. That's true. Mm -hmm. So it's happy days right here <laughs> and uh, on podcast. right? and it's very nice to to actually have him. Uh, I I call him uh, the master of uh, theatre, yeah. uh, or one of the masters in in, in theatre in South Africa and beyond, and also in in TV and film industry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, one of the best in the country or the the country has ever you know produced. Yes. Um, so Tasiga, I mean Tasilo, I know who to Right. Uh, 1960. 96 years. Yeah. How was it like to actually grow in Soweto during those days? And what were your, mm -hmm. um, you know, what were, were you dreaming of to become? Look, I mean, time? you know, I think my, my, my growing up in Soweto was when I was born up until I think probably six. Mm. <coughs> Excuse me. And then my mother got married, I think, around about that time when I was okay. six. And then I went to live in Atridville. But thinking of my Soweto time, mm. the little bit that I can recall, I mean, you know, it's before, I mean, six years. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Uh, there isn't, you know, much, much yeah. but that I can say, or, you know, of substance. So of you, you but one it. thing that I do remember, mm. you know, and re do recall is that um, my uncle, and that actually, you know, supports why maybe I ended up being a performer, mm, maybe mm, somehow. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, my uncle, I think when I was like about four years old, he would take me to, what do you call it, to the, to town on Saturdays, okay. you know. And uh, when we are in town, he would actually go, you know, like, play, you know, like, play, you know, the Indian shops. Mm. And, you know, like in the Indian, look, they always have a speaker on the pavement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Playing the recent okay. pop song, yeah. you know what I mean? Okay. Because mine is being much Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chigamachi. Uh, chigamachi. <laughs> ah, then my uncle will make us to go past. I and then you know those uh, ah, in the pavement, Spinner, Baba, Baba. on that the pavement. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. No, it was even before my. Oh, Baba, I mean, well, I didn't know Michael oh, yeah, Jackson. Oh yeah, yeah. It was even before. Yeah. It was even before. This I mean, like, man, I know Michael Jackson. Well, I think it's Michael. Yeah, yeah, I think Michael Jackson was. I think maybe fifty nine. Yeah. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, so okay. yeah, now nah, well maybe at the body end. Ah, no, 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 no. You know what? Now that you you say that, mm. because I think, you know, Michael Jackson, because the family, the father was actually making them to see. So yeah, he, was, he was doing yeah, A B C one two yeah, three yeah, yeah, yeah. one two yeah, three yeah. A B C yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I think maybe yeah, in, I think around, around, around about, about six years old. Okay. But then, so at that time, I mean, I'm four years old and jiggle up a pavement. Ah, okay. uh, before, <laughs> <Travolta>. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. Yeah. And my uncle will collect it. After that, some of the really fish and chips, yeah, yeah, fish and chips, at the cook, and as <laughs> and I think he was actually enjoying the rest yeah, of the yeah, yeah, yeah. But that is where you know that is how far I remember. And then about six years, my mother got married. Seven years, I started my you know sub A, mm. but in Etridgeville. Okay. So my schooling sub A up until what is grade one up and what sub A up until. What do you call it? Uh, Form one, one Form was one, was yeah. standard. Whatever I guess maybe we grade seven. Mm, okay. Is is it? Yeah. Is it, yeah. Form one is grade six. Yeah. For, yeah. I from one yeah, well, to like, grade now six. Well, I'm not in that. Grade, yeah, yes. <clears throat> you know, grade seven. King, grade eight, king, high school. High king. school. Yeah. Yeah. I think grade eight. No, 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 no. I think we think one. Eight, I, 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 I four years. Grade eight is actually still lower primary, ain't it? Okay. And then grade, oh yeah 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 it is isn't it primary. yeah grade is still like lower I primary mean, and then grade nine yeah you're yeah. one and then the yeah. grade nine and then we're not in that era that's it so I think I probably See, done that. I think it was grade yeah grade nine okay it was grade nine and then I I did that up until grade nine in 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 Etridgeville. Okay. and then grade uh, ten mm. I came to to Soweto. 
Seventy-six. Seventy-six. That is what. Seventy. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, grade ten, seventy-five. Okay. Yeah. That I is came just in, before the uprising. That that was before the the, the uprising. Yeah. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. So, in 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 a, basically, I was part of the uprisings. Oh, okay. Even though I didn't Throwing understand, stones. I didn't understand that Good thing. Hardcore. Oh, you know. So you not you were not sure what we were doing. Ah, uh, but it was mob psych, mob psychology. <laughs> you know, but when I went to throw it, and I and I go looter, mob looter. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah, you, now it's seen, older. you see the looting that was happening now, you know, because mm. I within mm. July eight. Yes, I remember. Yeah, that's the kind of looting. What <laughs> is it? Hey, we are dirty. Wow, now. <laughs> like I learned how to smoke, oh, you know. Okay. <laughs> you know, when I was seventy six, mm -hmm. because some of us are shy cutting. Oh yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah Not yeah. the cutting actually, the box, uh, uh, the whole box. It looks so like no meaning. Cows are throughout the month. Ah, the, the year, year ba, ba. The year. <laughs> almost throughout the year. Yeah, and then yeah, funa yeah. zang fundu pemi yoguting pemi lost throw. Ah, I know. Been fully twenty. Yeah, yeah. Mills. Yeah, I mills. Usai has mills. Me kumbole my baby's business. In team. In team. Me in team. Exactly. You got it. You got it. <laughs> so, but yeah, you know, um, but yeah, I think growing up in, in so, but then the good memory that comes, or, or with the memories that now are mm. there, it is actually when I was 15, and then it's 15, okay. then I see a play for the first time, oh, yes. watching Gibson Kenters, yeah. uh, how oh, long, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. you know, and mm. that is when, you know, the acting bug. So actually, when you started, uh, you actually started um, acting 1981? Professionally. 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 Okay, where? But as an amateur, I started in 76. Okay. Yeah. Do you you know, doing that? amateur plays. Yeah, yeah, but do, do you remember that oh, yes. excitement? Oh, oh, yes. And it was at an, at an Lady Hall. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah it was at an Lady Hall in, in 1976. Okay. I think it was January. It was actually just before the school opened. Okay. Yeah. I'm sure Sister Ria, I mean, my man, my was mm -hmm. watching it during those days. You know, probably. Because who okay, let's see, let's see. Okay, okay, in the little world, yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know? <laughs> so yeah, yeah, you know, so I, I mean, Do you I remember started, which play was it? Yes, it was called Shadi, okay. and in fact, in that play, that production, I mean, people who were my older brothers, mm -hmm. you know, I don't know if you know Len Masego, Len Masego okay. used to be the editor of Oh, yeah, and then there's also there's a guy, a photographer, but okay, Robert Maguaza. Mm. Okay, so that was, was the time about Akritlassen? Well, Before yes, oh yes, oh yes, ab ab absolutely, yeah, yeah you yeah. know. But uh, Len, Leonard, uh, Ulo Kudenorata, I mean, that is the nickname, Bissim Bizangala, Mava Begal Tafuli Ball. So, Bam Bizurata. You know, you must have a Tamukat, the judge now. Oh, yes, oh, he was big into him. Okay. So okay. you know, and it was yeah, and uh, man. I mean, I was what young teenager. They were mm -hmm. you know like mm -hmm. late teenagers, a 19, 18, 19 at that time. Okay. You know what I mean? So you were bang far a play. Oh. Okay. You know, my mom wanted to know yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. Well, yeah. I used to show. So mimic. we were over seventies there. 70, 76. 70, 76. 76. Before my riots. Okay. With okay, January. Okay, I still okay. remember that. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? And then, um, and then from there, I just continued. I mean, after 76, you know, and then, but what the, the June riots, mm. you know, schooling was not that yeah. hectically or another time. And by that time, I mean, more cooler. Then there's Abu. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. You know, and that time but pump pumpy below because the black consciousness. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, so yeah. after seventy six riots, bro, then I started waking up. Okay. You know, and now Barat had the way, you know, sharing things. Mm, mm. And now and I remember he being the sister of and Morris Isaacson. Okay. You know, no. so there was information that is being shared. Mm. You know, when I talk about like now, man, in my literature, I have poem, yeah. you yeah. know, band yeah. literatures, mm. you know, mm. literature, I talk about the founder of Malcolm X, the founder of Martin Luther King, you know, and sometimes somebody has got a um, no easy walk to freedom. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes, Nelson the, Mandela. The now you know what I mean? Group. And then, there were, <clears throat> you know, later on, then there were publications like mm -hmm. the Staff Rider, mm -hmm. you know, and the Staff Riders, I mean, they were K 
caring, I mean, like really um, political stuff. Mm. You so know. did you uh, like manage to meet uh, the likes of uh, who's that guy who started um, the the actual riots? Uh, it's it's machine. No, never really got to meet him, but you know, okay. yeah. But I mean, he was just like living within our mm, radar. Mm, mm, you know what I mean? And besides, after seventy six, he started going into hiding. Yeah, I remember. And then he actually even ended. I ended up in yeah, Nigeria. Nigeria yes, yeah, yeah, you know what okay. I mean. Uh, you know, people that I mean, because the one so, person that I actually then Mutsisi, okay, who actually I mean after TAT, uh, uh Seathulo, mm. basically became the leader of the Soweto Student Representative okay. Council. Okay. And then after, and I think it was Dan Mutsisi, mm. you know, and I think Dan, you know, actually, I, I knew about him, but I, I, I met him later, okay. you know, later years, actually, in the new dispensation. Yeah, I remember that you know. those days, uh, a lot of uh, comrades went to exile. A lot of know? comrades went to um, exile, and but that was also the rise of black consciousness, mm, mm, because at that time, ANC was not, uh, you know, was underground, expanded, yeah. you know, and uh, but Biko was the one, and the Sasso. Mm. Because Sasso was formed in 1969, yeah. and that was you know learning, you know starting the whole thing of mm. black consciousness. Mm. Mm. You know, I mean, I grew up basically on black consciousness and a little bit of PAC. Yeah. You know, that was because you know if you remember like but, but once I learned that the Mosanek, mm. the Khang Mosanek, yes, the, the, the yeah. former uh, deputies in uh, Tengela, CG. Okay. Um, you know, he grew up in Atteridgeville. Mm. You know, so PAC had a very in, in, in a strong, strong fold. Yeah. yeah, it was a you know little some stronghold. So PAC mm -hmm. continued. Mm -hmm. So influenza was black consciousness and and um, and PAC mm -hmm. and uh, like materials that we used to read. I mean, Imwapele wrote a poem. Uh, in fact, it's on YouTube. People must check it out. Okay. You know, it's okay. called Africa, my beginning, Africa, my ending. Yes, ah, yes, I remember bro. that poem. You Zorro know, we also did just uh, you know, revive it. <laughs> they came sailing from the east to the west with hatred and disease in their skins mm. and a burden to harden our lives. And when foreigner met foreigner, they fought for the rain, exploiters of Africa. Africa, my beginning. Yeah, Africa, Africa my end. ending. I know, good to that it sounds that poem is close to your heart. No, it is. I mean, on you, you, exactly. You know, <clears throat> and I mean, you know, I mean, when we were growing up, we were speaking about conscientizing ourselves. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And I think even now, you know, I find myself like even when I want to kind of try to tell stories, mm. I can't tell stories since I was King, Boys in the Hood and Skopsky <laughs> yeah. and Donald. Yeah. Because you've got to deliver a message that actually heightens mm. people's awareness mm. about their environment. Yes. Because at that time it was important that we heighten Mm. Our awareness and our consciousness, black consciousness, okay. it had to do with you as a black person recognizing what in a, I mean, you know, mm. we talk about Black Lives Matter. Mm. Mm. At that time, you were saying, I matter. I, yeah, that's true. You know, I am a human mm. being. Mm. And hence, I mean, you know, like the, a lot of children or the children of uh, the generation of uh, 76. Mm. Many of them, the whole thing of children having African names mm. starts with that generation. Yeah. We always had them, but we never used them, mm. you know. Uh, but in 76, we dropped the whatever English names, mm. you know, even though we had them and never used them. That is why, yeah. that is why, I mean, Maisha Maponya, Ingwapela Madingwan, and all that that we were literally basically like saying we're using we're not using slave names mm -hmm. and the whole thing of not combing hair it's not I, I, I call him my wife I mean his wife when, oh, that's it yes yeah. 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 No, I'm sorry. Mm, no, sorry. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah, we had a very nice conversation. Mm, interview. Yeah. Yeah, with mm -hmm. her. She was telling me about uh, this handsome uh, uh, guy at that time. Oh, below, I'm stripping. Oh, my days. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he had a boy, like, why is it about to burn my kids <laughs> with my Yeah. You know, I mean, we got to make sure that when we do things, <laughs> we do them proper. 
Yeah. <laughs> but he was a brilliant, um, you know. No, he was a pl- brilliant playwright and, yes, and a poet. Yes, and I think yes. also an artist, if I'm not, I'm not mistaken, a mm, fine artist, mm, mm. you know. But he was into theatre, he was into poetry, mm. you know what I mean? I mean, those were... Like, like the older generation, Yana, you know, the that, Mahrot time, Manzaro, yeah, Mahrot Man, yeah. that we were actually learning Even from. For you, yeah. you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And I think that is one thing that is a problem at this present moment because along the, the most of the young generation today, mm-hmm. they are not actually being and are not growing. Basically, having a community or oh, yeah, a, 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 yeah, a, a generational conversation with our generation. Yeah. Yeah. But we are to be, to be blamed mm-hmm. for that mm-hmm. because people who are or maybe even controlling the mm-hmm. space mm-hmm. are not mm-hmm. making sure that we actually continue to have those communications. Mm-hmm. And there's this whole notion, Yahore, you know, we have, you know, we, 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 we got to get young talent, mm-hmm. but that young talent is growing in a vacuum. In a vacuum. Yeah, you know what I mean? Because it is not working in relation or understanding what mm-hmm. was before mm-hmm. them. Mm-hmm. My generation too, was actually suffering, or even the the generation be just before me. Mm. Take for now, for instance. Now, um, if I would ask you, if I I did that exercise mm. in eighty seven, okay. and I was with my colleague uh, Louis, who we were doing was Albert together, mm. and I asked him a question. I said, Louis, can you give me names of white actors? Who are Dr. John Gunn's uh, contemporaries? Okay. And at that time, in it, he went on. To, he went to town, bro. Mm. You know, so mm. and so, Charles Comey, Noms you know, Joe Stewartson, and other beats, Sean Taylor, whatever, whatever. I said, okay. Now, give me black actors mm. who are Dr. John Gunn's contemporaries and who are working in the theatre. And then bro. he went, John Gunn. He couldn't even finish a hand yeah. in the country of how many millions. Oh, yeah. And that, and now I can ask you even today, how many actors do you know who are Dr. John Gunn's contemporaries and are working in the theatre? Yeah, no. If I will remember, there will be obviously few. You see what I mean? Yeah. And also, there is my generation In a country of how many millions, by mm. Horne, they are working constantly. Or even, maybe let me not go my generation, mm. say the generation above me, and the generation just above me, Kibo Prita, Brapitas Puma, Bo Darlington Michaels, mm. that generation. Mm. Can you tell me of those who are working in the theater? Or even in the television? They are mm. not there. Yeah. So what is happening? And so we're not realizing is that is that this generation is being wiped off or made obsolete so you while it is party. still alive. Yeah, there's a problem there. There's a problem there. Mm. Do, 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 do you see what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So, and if we are not watching, and I remember when I made that in Tengela, one um, situation that I had, and that guy is actually Bra John Kani, mm. Dr. John Kani's contemporary. And his name is... Uh, Zakes Mukai. Okay. I met with Brad Zakes go Zimbabwe. Okay. He was exiled. He left, I think, in the 60s. Okay. You know, and never came back. But when I met Brad Zakes, Kontengila, who is Brad John Ghani's contemporary, mm-hmm. that is where I actually, I would say, I had an interaction with yeah, that with, with yeah. that generation. Mm. You know, I mean, and also I think the other person that I met was um, Lionel Ngakan, Tate Lionel mm-hmm. Ngakan. Mm-hmm. So those, that is a generation. So you are a lucky few. Um, exactly. Mm-hmm. And that is when I met uh, Brazil that I realized that some way, somehow I've been growing up in a vacuum. Mm-hmm. Because that generation, there wasn't work that was making it possible. And that time I'm 26, 27, 28. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And I'm not even getting an opportunity to work hmm. with that with, with that generation. That's a problem. Yeah, that's a problem. You it's know, a disconnect. There's a disconnect, yeah. and the black people we are suffering from a chronic, chronic disconnection. Mm. Yeah. Chronic from the point of 
colonization from the you know to say the least it is, yeah. you know because colonization when it came it disrupted life of african people mm. Black mm. people were made servants in their own land. Yeah. Why mm. black people struggle with entrepreneurship? It's because of colonization. Mm. Mm. It is because of the dispossession of land. Yeah. You know, when 19, I mean, next year is going to be the 110th anniversary of the Land Act. Yeah. Which is going to make a Ntengina Barking. I mean, when the Land Act was passed in 1913, mm. black people, you woke up the following day after the land, uh, the, the Act was passed, mm. not belonging. You're just right there. Just right there. You never belonged. Mm. You actually, black people had to cede their land to, maybe if, if ever they were sharing that space with white people, to white people, and became laborers. Yeah. So, and now you understand why we are constantly thinking, I've got to get a job. I mean, that is what I'm saying, that mm -hmm. uh, once the land was colonized, mm -hmm. it eventually colonized the, the mind. The mind. As well, mm -hmm. you know? No, I so mean, it goes without results. saying. It goes without saying. Mm. And that is why we actually don't feel even a sense of belonging. Mm -hmm. And also, look at how now that we have passed on the DNA of not of not feeling that we have ownership, that even young people today when at the universities, they destroy the universities because at Little Naka 76, we were burning buildings. Yes, yeah. Because we never had a sense of belonging and we don't even realize that things have changed now. Mm -hmm. We can't be thinking about destroying the infrastructure yes. in order to make our voices mm -hmm. heard. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And so again, we're using the same methods. Exactly. We're using the same <laughs> methods that were used in the olden days. Yeah. And Honayano, what we actually need to be doing is like, hey, hey, we've got to look each other in the eye and say, hey, don't mess around with me. Mm. Don't mm. F me up. Mm. You know, and mm. basically, if ever we look at the environment and we look at the leadership that is going, uh, that what is doing, they're effing us up. Mm. And we mm. need to be able to talk. You know, man to man. You know, when you say that, um, it sounds very um, clear to me because um, there was a situation whereby mm -hmm. there was a, a an unrest. Let me yeah. call it a protest yeah. over service delivery. Yeah. Uh, somewhere in Soweto. Right. So these guys were, you know, the complaint was about electricity, mm -hmm. the usual stuff. Yes. Know? But uh, you'll find uh, people um, blocking a way for yeah. people to go to the hospital. Yeah. So I'm thinking, how? Oh, Exactly. And then what about Ukoko or Gulayo mm. or let me just say in J Pesin or Gulayo or say or send in or Melangene Because Laban Bafunu to Uvo Rabos Vagale to the government about electricity, but we we're disturbing That's uh, it. health service. We have we, so it's a very we, are, we have to change you know how we look at things and we have to change mm, our mm, thinking. Mm. Because even with that with that with the barking protests. Mm. And then people will go and block the roads with trash and whatever. Mm. When they are done, they don't remove it. Yeah. There's a very interesting example of protest that happened in Japan. Okay. And one that happened in South Africa. Okay. You remember when there was a bus boycott? Oh yes. In South yeah, Africa. Yeah, I remember. That very same time it coincided with a bus boycott yeah. in Japan. Mm. And you know what the Japanese were doing? The drivers were waking up, going to work, yeah. picking up the buses, yes. driving but not making people to pay. Oh, okay. That's a very interesting one. Exactly. Methodology. So they knew, basically, the people who felt the pinch were the bus company, mm. the bus corporation, mm. Mm. the bus owners. Mm. And Runa, when we protest, we affect everybody else. Yeah. Ex yeah. And those who are in Tungila, they're sitting at a distance. When I believe they're sitting nicely. Yeah. yeah. Or are or happy that we are not the only ones who are affected. Yes. And we got to start thinking that when we do things, let them be pointed and be well directed. Yeah, that's true. But just looking uh, at mm. at um, the generation in terms of when we were fighting um, mm. for freedom. Yes. And we got the freedom. Mm -hmm. we ha we're having democracy. Mm -hmm. you know, the new dispensation, 1994, yes. it was nice and all that. But um, now looking back until now, mm -hmm. 
Um, do you think um, we have um, uh, a positioned democracy to, in a right fashion in terms of making us the country to gain? You, know? you, 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 you want me to talk about my happiness? <laughs> <laughs> you know, because that's, uh, there's a lot that is going on and um, for a whole lot of young people, it's a worrisome factor. You know, now what I think is that history is going to judge us harshly. Mm. You know what I mean? And uh, even lay for, because, you know, like they say, we are a country that has, you know, unequal society. Mm. Yes. At first, that in an unequal society was between black and white. Mm. But at the moment, so it is between white and the a few black halves. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. And the masses yeah. of the have not. Mm. And uh, what is, I think, people who are actually just having it nicely now, mm. I don't think they're thinking about the future. Yes. Because they are going to find themselves in the very same position that the boors. Mm. found themselves in. There's going to be a revolt. Mm. There's going to be a revolt. Yeah. And instead of when we came into power, we made sure that we create and Tengla Barking somewhat an equal society because mm. we know, you know, but others saw themselves as more deserving than others. others. Yeah. You know what I mean? I mean there was this one politician who said, I didn't go into the struggle to be poor. Do you think or the other people born? They lived in South Africa so that they must be poor. Yes. Yeah. You know what I mean? So. And the people tend to think or those who went to exile are the ones who fought. Yes. And forget that we lived with the fighting. Yes, yes. We, yes, yes, yes. Lord, we never went yeah. away. Some guy said, lived with um, the resistance. Yeah, Chagula ni na ena ya u exile. Si na yitebe sa experience ama ama lona ama. My no, internet, my, exactly. I mean, you know, any, I mean, you, you know, one cannot deny the way, the, yeah, the you know, years. the way few by long horne, maybe they were living, and that is maybe even the leadership. Mm. But mm. those are yeah, hey man, if you went out, out into, into barking outside the country, mm. yeah, hey man, they were, they, were, nice. they, were, they were living nice. Yeah, when you're like, saying that, even the, the, the I, I, yeah. I, when I read about this machine, and I heard mm. that when he was in Nigeria, mm -hmm. he actually um, turned against um, um, other comrades. In fact, mm. comrades, um, mm. you, know? You, you, you know what I mean? And, and, that, is, that, and, that, is, and that is, I think, so even well, basically. Like, Mitu yeah. Mitu yeah. Exactly. I, and it can say no matter what else you know i mean sometimes <laughs> you, you know thing that makes sometimes and it makes it sound very almost patronizing mm. when you hear our leadership talking our people uh, we we working this for our people mm. you know mm, but it's not you're saying you're saying our people but where are you living mm. you know what i mean are you still living with those people Cater deployment. Yeah, well, yeah, nah, that, 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 that is, <laughs> those are the frills you know what yeah, i mean yeah. but the thing is are we making sure, Hori, we all rise up, you know, Same and way. as a nation, and a as thing, and, and also, it is, I mean, mm -hmm. we had recreational facility, facilities mm -hmm. during apartheid years than we have more here. Yeah, that's true. You know what I mean? And, mm -hmm. and that is disheartening. Mm -hmm. And somehow people, when you start saying that, they say you are an apartheid sympathizer. So for a there. child who loves theatre now, uh, where to go? I'm, bro, <laughs> and uh, you see, like, I mean, it is not even, uh, we have to, we should have created environments. Mm. They, you know, like, there is this, maybe, like, little things that are happening, like, somebody does an incubation here. Mm. And we're creating hopefuls of Ntengela performers. But not creating an environment that they can work in, mm -hmm. you know what I mean. And art, the art, the the performing arts is actually taken as you know a side uh, bar thing, mm -hmm. and whereas it should be the main core of call. the society, mm -hmm. you know. When you're doing this podcast, it mm -hmm. is some other way of actually disseminating information yes. and of entertainment. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah, but there are people yeah. who actually are gifted or have the talent to give performances in singing, in dance, mm, and whatever. Mm. But also that has got to happen with training. That's true. You know, we were the unfortunate. I mean, when I was growing, to think of going to study drama at varsity, 
Where? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but where? You know what I mean? Yeah. But despite all that, I made myself to be the actor that I am today. Mm. You know? Mm. But I, young people who are growing up today shouldn't have that. Well, they do have opportunities. They go to the Avdas, they go to the, what you call it, City in Tuengela and Barking City, maybe some City Varsity. Yes. You know what I mean? And these institutions are even very expensive. And then they go to Vets, mm -hmm. UCT, and whatever. And here's what happens you have graduates that have got no jobs. Yeah. And it is not only in all these other aspects. Some mm -hmm. Tuengela, some. You know, they, you know, the others are uh, working other fields, like accounting, whatever. It happened, it's happening all around. Mm -hmm. And whereas, during the apartheid years, Amapun had performing art councils. There was PACT, which was called um, uh, again, Performing Art Council of Transvaal, because they had four provinces four, yeah, there. Yeah. And there was PECOFs, Performing Arts Council of the Orange Free State. NAPEC. Natal mm -hmm. Performing Arts Council, mm -hmm. KPAC, mm -hmm. uh, Cape Performing Arts Council. And these art councils had companies. Mm -hmm. There was the drama company, there was the ballet company, mm -hmm. and there was the opera company. So the performing arts were well catered for. Mm -hmm. So young people who basically were coming out of varsities, coming out of Pretoria Tech, uh, University of Pretoria, they knew where to start to go get into working there, they had a doorway yeah. that led them into the industry. Mm. But no. No. Hey. There's nothing like that. You see what I mean? So it's about the IFAD all together. We're living through very difficult times and we've got to rethink our situation. Mm. So but looking at the silo, uh, we, we, the theater work that you've done, mm -hmm. which one, I know what you love them all, but mm -hmm. which one you say, yeah, these were the years, you know. You mean, I mean, between theater or between theater and... No, theater film. itself. Ah, bro, you know, I mean, I think the, you, you, I have landmarks. Mm. You know, uh, Gibson, basically, my debut in 1981. Okay. Um, after 1981, then the next production that really was a turning point for me was doing was Albert. Mm -hmm. You know, and it was a bit me, bro. I tell you, it's a whoa, it's an actor's jam. Okay, it's Everyone an actor's to do was a bit, yeah, at that time, yes, even now, even now. <laughs> yeah. But the one thing about, excuse me, that about that uh, play is that it needs a lot of preparation. Mm -hmm. Was a bit is not a play that you rehearse. You know, like in three weeks or four weeks, okay. and that and that is nah, it's out table, <laughs> it's out table. Yeah, yeah. Because Rosa yeah. Albert is a very barking. It's well, what they would even call physical theater. Mm, mm, mm. You know, mm. it needs fitness. You need to know your story. It needs training mm. of a certain kind. Your vocal and twangy barking. Your voice has got to be trained in a certain way. Your fitness mm. has got to be almost like the fitness of a football player. Mm. That's, you know, basically. So, but, or, you know, people who are actually fit, you know, and best are uh, ballet dancers. Okay. Or dancers. Dancers are fit. Okay. And dancers work hard. Amongst, mm -hmm. I think, the, think the performing arts, you know, the laziest yeah. is actors. <laughs> oh, the laziest. The laziest. Ah, yeah, yeah. Actors, my boss, my biscuit. Yeah, yeah. Action, da, 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 da. <laughs> That, that, and we can yeah, yeah, yeah. Bamba Jama, I'm alive. I'm alive. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. And, then, ooh, and then you fatu, say, Yeah, yeah. Dancers, if you look at dancers, my bro, and especially like well trained, let's say even ballet or what you call it, contemporary dancing, mm -hmm. they have worked on their bodies. On you the, see yeah, yeah, the yeah, work that yeah. they have done on yeah, their bodies. Yeah. You know what I mean? And basically, fitness goes a long way. A long way. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But acting also can be demanding mm -hmm. unless, you know, and, and basically it's going to need a certain, a, a different way of training mm -hmm. the actor. Mm -hmm. Because the, person, the, the actor that we have today is very lazy. Yeah. Very, very lazy. Okay. And the actors of today, you know, they talk about, you know, when I get into character, you know, when I 
<laughs> I mean, that is the biggest BS. What do you think maybe Amaita should do uh, just when you're talking about laziness? Okay. Well, and other people who, are work, who work hard mm. are musicians. Okay. Either a piano player. Or, or a piano, piano player. Yeah. Or a piano player. No, they practice their oh, they, practice. they learn their instruments that they okay. have to play. Even, like, for instance, if you look at singing, but also from the perspective of opera mm. or even of jazz singing, mm. singers work on their voice. voices. You know what I mean? Mm. Mm. Actors, what do we do? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, this whole thing for me, uh, actors talking about, you know, when I get into character, there's no getting into character. Mm. Character is defined by actions. Okay. Okay. First time when I met, oh, when we met recently. Yeah. Go ENC. Yes, yes. You are playing a role. Yeah. What were you? Producer. Oh, uh, yeah, content producer. Content yeah. producer. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And now, are you a content producer now? No. No. You are the interviewer. Yeah. And the actions have changed. Yes. Yes. So yes. now, if I've got to write, a character of a content producer. I cannot write him and have him in front of the mic. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Do you see what I mean? Yeah. I'm going to write him and look at, no, he does this, he calls whatever, mm, discusses mm, with the mm, interviewers, mm. coordinate. Yeah, or, you're only exact, a Exactly. Yeah. And you're doing different actions. Now that you are an interviewer, you're doing a different yeah. series of series actions. Of, yeah. You know what I mean? And those actions, if ever you're doing it, I'm going to write them. Or no, okay. He, 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 you know, this guy's a podcast producer mm -hmm. uh, or whatever interviewer, and then he comes, he prepares into the stuff that he wants to do, you know, and he, you know, okay, okay you know, you know, who looks at me at your cap, he looks at me, and you, you know, when are <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, you yeah. are in your role, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good do, do, do you see what I mean? Yeah, Ex and you out. worked how you want to do it, so that is it. Mm -hmm. Character mm -hmm. is defined by actions, and writers write the series of actions mm -hmm. that the character has got to play. Mm -hmm. A guy who's a thug, the, car the, the, the writer is going to write on the when's a saw, when's a saw, when's a saw, when's a saw, when's a saw. Mm -hmm. And all you've got to do is do that, do yeah, those actions yeah, yeah, as yeah. believable as you can. Mm -hmm. But now here's the thing. As actors, in fact, the human being, the way it is designed, we are designed to remember, I think, or oh, yeah. st store information. Yeah, yeah. And hence, that is even when a person goes to a common bargaining for a psychologist, mm. once they sit, you know, to a shrink, once they sit in the chair, there's one thing, the one familiar question that would be asked would be, how was your childhood? Mm. Mm. How was your upbringing? How was your upbringing? <laughs> you know what I mean? And then there you are going to be talking about the experiences that mm. you had and those experiences are influencing how you are yes. reacting to life yes, now. Yes, 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 you know, yes. and basically based on that and because the body has got an innate sense mm. Mm. of uh, truth mm. and the body remembers. Hence the trauma that you would feel. Your body would remember it. Mm. Mm. You know what I mean? And, but it is remembering it, well, it is stored in the mind, but also in the body. The example that I make is, have you ever had either maybe a very acrimonious fight or breakup? Mm. Mm. Maybe with your, you know, you were dumped or whatever. Mm. 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 And you don't see this person for almost a year. Mm. And but your heart was ripped apart. Yeah, yeah. The day you see that person again, mm. that whole experience comes Close. back to life. Yeah. Now, this is what an actor has got to do. An actor has got to master remembering different kinds mm. of sensations mm. 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 and be able to execute them on demand. Mm. Mm. A pianist. When they have learned their instrument, when you ask them, give me G, yeah, yeah, yeah. they don't totally say, I've knows. got to get into musical character first, Before and then I give, give you that note. No, they go to the note. Mm. And all the other information that we entangle are some kind of musical notes mm. Mm. 
that when you have to recall them, you have to recall them on demand and without any strife. Mm. If, for instance, I have to maybe play a character that, oh Lord, I've got to cry. Yeah, which is this person who experiences trauma. And, and that's who we are color right now. You see what I mean? That's what it's got to do. And I'm not going to do Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah, but yeah. But those are the things oh, that you've got to... Oh, my God, what's he? No. <laughs> because the body is stupid. The bodies are manable. Mm. And basically, actors have got to train their bodies yeah. so that they control how, when the they emotions. want things. Yeah. yeah, when they need an emotion. You've got to be trained and train yourself oh, in such a way. It's so difficult, though. Yeah. <laughs> you see, but again, the tools of acting mm. are already with us. Yes. Crying, laughing, mm. getting mm. angry, and that's everything. how we live. Yeah. That's how we yeah. live. Yeah. Shakespeare says all the world is a stage. Yes. And every yes. man and woman merely players making their exits and entrances. Yes. Every time we are we honor yeah. what we are doing. If for instance in the discussion. In the discussion. Yeah. But let's take, you know, Hore, this whole conversation gets transcripted mm. and it's put on a page. Okay. And then given to actors. Mm. <laughs> Do you see what I mean? <laughs> and then the actor must live up to that. Exactly. Yeah. The and and, and then now here's another thing. When words are on the page, we tend to call them lines. Yeah, my lines are. Are we speaking lines now? <laughs> or are we communicating our thoughts? Yeah. So words on the page are not lines. Are thoughts yes, yes, of the characters. Yes, yes. The characters are expressing thoughts. Yeah. As I'm saying that I'm expressing a yes, thought, yes, it, I mean, it is a thought. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, that's very interesting. To see. It, uh, <laughs> yeah. We're still on a happy days on our podcast, and uh, it's always a happy day to have a good day, I always say. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can actually catch us on www, um, what is it, uh, coldrawmedia.co.za if you want to get up, I mean, to reach out to us. Maybe mm -hmm. you want to advertise um, uh, a silo market episode that would be very nice mm -hmm. you know um, we still really need support you know, nee, okay, in all okay, senses okay. so that's, you know, if you can tell me maybe you tell our viewers mm -hmm. uh, com in comparison to a stage um, and then a film and film and, yeah. and acting just yeah. on TV mm -hmm. what's your you know preference I know you, you and I, I, like I say I love them both yeah but there's there's something I mean I you know like I I, I separate them in this manner mm. that there is theater and there is because television and film mm. they're using camera yes okay. you know what I mean so there's theater and there is camera acting mm. Mm. and now people tend to say uh, there are two types of acting okay. which would be Theater acting and uh, camera, camera acting. acting yeah. I beg to differ. Okay. The only difference about these two mediums is that they deal with space. Okay. I'll wait for your explanation because yes. when I say something, I'll, I'll okay. Do, yeah. Camera. Okay. You're dealing with either this space or this space. Yeah. Or yeah, this space, yeah. or this space. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's the space that mm. you are working mm. in. Theater. The, the you. You're dealing with an open space. Okay, okay. You know what I mean? Mm. Now, and the, the difference is with camera, you've got a mic here. Mm. And either the mic will be either hanging there or being. Yeah. Yeah. you know, caught underneath mm -hmm. so that it doesn't show mm -hmm. or somehow it will be attached yes, to your clothes. Yes, yes, yes. You know what I mean? So that's, you know, that's the camera acting part okay. of it. Okay. With theater, you're dealing with acting in an open space. Mm -hmm. And every day of our lives, we are actually even in a space of theater. Mm -hmm. when so life is theater. Life is theater. Mm -hmm. And I look at how the body operates. If ever, for instance, even now I'm going to say, hey, hey, tada, you know, mm. when he's a little fat, I said, hey, hey, tada, yeah, yeah. you know, yeah. and with it, 
And look, did you see what, what I did yeah, before yeah. I spoke? Yeah. I took a deep breath. Mm, mm. So which is breathing in the space. Yes, yes. Because you are aware, Horna, you've got, your voice has got to reach further away. Advert, yeah, 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 telecom. More and more, more, more I mean. yeah. do, do, do you see what I mean? <laughs> yeah, but yeah. now, give an actor that molom shobo one. Mm, mm, mm. And the wounds. Let's pause this. Yeah, I'll take a picture guy. Do you know what I mean? So yeah. it is actually just understanding the space that you are working in. Mm, and people, mm, ordinary mm. people, watch ordinary people. For instance, if you go to a church, not the charismatic where there's mm, my, but Hona and Kerekeka of Elada, you know, people are lazy. Mm. And that is actually, that laziness is actually even creeping into the theater. But when you went to churches, you know, like your Presbyterian church, mm, mm. your Wessel church and whatever, Mike's, you know, PA systems are things that are coming now. Mm. Before, reverence or priests, whatever, they would preach or even talk in the church, in the church yeah. without microphones. <laughs> That's true. You know what I mean? Mm. And that is where also, again, you understand theater. Mm. You know what I mean? Because when people come and maybe they give testimonies, you know, they will say, um, you know, uh, and they speak in such a way that they are being heard mm. Mm. by everybody. Even people when they are actually barking gumba protest, yeah, yeah, and there's the leader, um, um, comrades, yeah. uh, this is what we are going to do yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. We are going to make sure that whatever <laughs> happens is this and yeah, this. Yeah. And comrades, there's got to be discipline. Please, man, please, please. let's have discipline, <laughs> comrades. Order, order, comrades, <laughs> oh, comrade. Yeah. Order, you know what I mean. Yeah, and then true. give it an actor. So uh, comrades, yeah. comrade, order. Order, comrade. <laughs> no, but you see, and that is why it is somehow there's something very lazily that is happening in acting, mm. and there are always like wrong, working ways of acting that are being taught to mm. people. First acting lesson that I got was break was I mean the person gave me a breakdown of the word actor. Yeah, he said A stands for action. C stands for creativity. Mm. T stands for technique. Okay. O stands for observation. Mm. R stands for reaction. All these five things mm. you use as an actor. Mm. But the most important one, excuse me, is observation. Mm. Mm. Before an actor can even want to try and attempt to act, observe yeah. first. first yeah. What is it that you are going to be doing? Mm. And if you observe life outside, do mm. your own research. You know, observe Batu. Mm. People are different kinds of characters. Mm. And then you observe yourself. Mm. That's true. You observe yourself for a, when I'm in a state of doubt, how am I? Mm. For an ordinary person, when they get into a fight with somebody, mm. they just go, oh, no, young dinner. you know, this one pisses me off. Yeah, yeah, they just know. go through the experience. Mm. But as an actor, when you do it, you say, oh, so this is how I am mm. when I'm pissed off. Quite and then you remember also the sensation of it because it comes with a sensation. Mm. Mm. When you are in love as well, you remember, mm. oh, when I'm in love and I'm feeling my boyfriend, who my baby. Mm. Mm. You remember that. What is ordinary to the ordinary person? For an actor, it is not ordinary. Not. It is a tool. It is something that you've got to learn in order to be able to reproduce. Yeah, yeah. Simple as that. Oh, man. Because um, I wanted to say um, about um, uh, theater. Yes. I remember... My, the old days, you know, mm -hmm. um, years back, I didn't like um, a theater. Yeah. My, my friend used to say, let's go uh, to uh, watch theater. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm a grand mother Yeah, I'm a grand mother of the things. Yeah. I'm just going to have a stage. But that is the thing. Know. And the thing was, there was a way in Mulai Tolo, which it was happening very wrongly. Mm -hmm. Theater has got to happen in such a way that when you're watching the story, it's almost that you are seeing life unfolding before but you. Does, you know, it doesn't happen eventually. I 
can tell you that much. Yeah. You know. Okay. Um, a, a, a brother of mine mm -hmm. who was now um, was employed at yeah. the Jobek Theatre. Right. The right. The guys were preparing stage. You know. That's it. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So um, okay, actually you gave, you gave me a ticket, ticket for yeah. uh, what was this King Kong? Right. Okay. You know, right. Okay. I see. I see. Like Mangu Endling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like so you. I was like, I hear you. change of mindset because mm -hmm. you can't say to a thing you don't like it. Yeah. You know, that's a mistake sometimes. No, but, but you also, know the, 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 you know, I understand that. But also, there is an aspect that is not happening right, and mm. which is where you find that things tend to be too exaggerated. Mm. Now, other people who would talk about theater acting and camera acting, and I say there's only two types of acting. Good and bad. Yes. So people do See, bad acting. Do yeah. Good, do bad acting, and they say it is theatre acting. Mm -hmm. You know, and whereas if you're the master of your craft, you've got to do it so seamlessly that as you're doing it, the person doesn't even think that you're doing. You, you are acting. Yeah, yeah. They see life unfolding, unfolding. before you, yes, before yes, them. Yes, yes. You know, but I guess we will get there at some yeah. point. Because when I was watching that King Kong, mm -hmm. the guy who was acting King Kong uh, actually made me to see because I it was just the story of uh, the 80s. That's it, no, 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 50s. The 50s, 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 50s. So I was like, how, this is how King Kong was. You know? Sophia Town. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. I was like, mm -hmm. yeah, no. So I can like relate. That's it. Yeah. Some of the things. Yes. You know? yeah. So that is why I just fell in love with the yeah. theater. No, the, 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 theater. 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 Is, you know, unlike television. Mm. Television. Your your performance is made on the editing table. Mm. 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 Go to edit again, Yeah. Go to edit again, Yeah. There's no but second take there. In the theater. Well, your performance, okay. everybody is seeing it complete. Yeah. So yeah. if it didn't work, yeah, it, it just didn't work. work. Yeah. Exactly. That's true. That's true. Yeah. And then now talking about uh, theater, mm -hmm. um, let's talk about March uh, and uh, to April. Yeah. I know that um, you couldn't contain the excitement. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. When, when you were told about uh, the untold truth. You know, what is okay. the, the new uh, the play? The, nothing. Uh, the play, nothing but the truth. Yeah. Nothing yeah. but yeah. the truth, mm. Mebrur, is a I play. I want to quote you here, but yeah. I just want to feel the excitement. That's it, okay. <laughs> nothing but the truth is a play written by Dr. John Kang. Mm. Mm. Boy, what a the play. Guru. Yeah. What a play. That play, Fana, I, and when I saw Brad John doing it, mm. and, and here's another, but well, this time I'm making it happen my, for myself. <laughs> you know, I like that. But others, I, uh, you know, as I was checking, I think I depended on what life gave mm -hmm. me. But I was fortunate in my career that all the things that I wanted to do, I mean, the very first play that I debuted in, yeah, but I keep, mm -hmm. I actually saw it first before okay. I was in it. Mm -hmm. And I remember when I was watching it and watching the guy who was playing the character that I came to play, and I was like watching that, and I was like, what is I can play that. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna, I yeah. don't sing I shy, but I said I can play the yeah. part. Yeah, <laughs> you yeah, know. Yeah. And then came uh, was Albert. Okay. Was Albert before I acted in it, I saw Mbongeni and um, Pesimto mm. doing it. You know. And I remember watching it, I said, Wow, this is really a very nice thing to do. Mm. You know. And then it happened, I think, in 1985, then somebody came, Brad Dixon, came looking for me to come and do Oza Albert with him, mm. you know. And then now I saw this play, Abra John, and I said, Esh. I mean, I liked it, mm. you know. I remember just liking it. I never thought or nay, I would want to do it, Dude, you know, yeah. but I just loved it. It was beautiful, mm. beautiful, and Brad John was as they say in today's language, killing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was <laughs> you know. Yeah. So I'm going into something in Lorne. I saw somebody killing, killing it. But yeah. anyway, Limbongen, when I, you know, when he did was Albert, he was killing, killing it. it. Yeah. You know, yeah. but then I came and then just said, show it Orne, well, you know, I can Let do this. No, well. I don't know. I don't know about <laughs> killing it. People will you describe went. whether, <laughs> you know. But, you know, but nothing but the truth I saw Brad John doing and I remember 
even at moments, Lohana, you know, I was, as I was rereading it now, mm. I was almost, as I was reading it, almost empathizing with the character to the point. Yahore, mm. I was barking, getting misty eyed. Mm. You know, almost coming close to tears as I'm reading mm. some moments and laughing at others. Mm. You know what I mean? And I, and I just thought, yeah, no, this one. I know why yeah. I want to do. Yeah. Nothing but the truth, Fana, is a story about. In fact, it is. It took protest theater into the social space. Mm. It's not that is from now. It is almost like a social protest play okay because it's about social issues mm. it's about uh, sibling rivalry mm. okay you know what i mean and uh, there's no person who doesn't have issues mm. yeah. with their siblings social, yeah <laughs> you know what i mean yeah. it's just that you can't go and stand on the platform yeah, 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 yeah you know yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> and who, who demonstrated yeah, who demonstrate or away that. with my younger brother but you know it deals with you know barking uh, sibling rivalry yes. but also it deals with this how, how our society or family structures were operating mm -hmm. and uh, you know and it touches on elements of the effects of of uh, of the of the time, <laughs> but you know, yes, and also how you know, barking the parents of the character Yabra John, mm. where the, where their headspace, okay, you know, how were they operating, and also it tells the story of, you know, it connects with the struggle, mm. you know, because he had a younger brother who was connected to the struggle. Mm. It's a play about. Civil rivalry, rivalry, and it's also a play about the subverting, the desires that people have, mm -hmm. and uh, how we all want to attain certain dreams. Mm -hmm. And this guy also had his own, barking ambitions, mm -hmm. you know, and also, also how, for instance, black people, or in fact, that how we can just affect each other with the actions that we do to one yes. another. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And uh, the whole civil rivalry story, you know, I don't want to spoil it for people, yeah. is that it is very, very intense. Yeah. You know, and uh, a lot of people could either I relate to it by knowing a story similar to it mm. or oh. having experienced it themselves. Okay. Yeah. I see you also actually put it on your Facebook here. Mm -hmm. You, I just would quote you here mm -hmm. uh, where you say... Um, you, you need to do your best always and don't wait for anyone to tell you um, that you are the great. God rewards excellent always. Mm -hmm. Look, so those mm -hmm. things just touched me. Mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, Look, you, you know, you know yeah. sometimes there are times um, um, you are the only person that you can tell yourself good things. Mm -hmm. If you wait to be told good things by other people, they may never even come. So wake up and just. So you got you got to be you got to be able to say to measure yourself as that like you did well on that. Mm -hmm. I've got two things. Also, you know, like in, in this one, I learned it from this guy, and I remember seeing and turning over king VHS, you know, tape. Yeah, uh, you know, you, do you know VHS? I VHS yeah. You know VHS. VHS was even Betamax. Betamax, they are. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know yeah. those tapes before mm. there were DVDs and all mm, that. Mm, mm. Mm. And this guy, Berkman Les Brown, mm. he tells a story of himself, Aliko, at school, mm. and uh, does something or doesn't want to or to do something because he doesn't think he's got the capabilities to do so. Mm. And the teacher says, or in fact, he actually describes himself, himself, and he says, uh, "Sorry, sir, but I am, you know, sort of academically um, not educated, uh, educatable. Basically, some kind okay. of, uh, you know, he doesn't have, maybe some, you know, only problem learning, yeah. pro learning problem. Okay, has a learning problem, 
And he said, you must never, you know, don't let anybody's opinion about you become your reality. Mm -hmm. And that statement stayed with me for the longest of time. And, um, and I'm using it when uh, the opinion is negative yeah. and as well when the opinion is positive. positive yeah. Because even if when you say, you're, hey, Silla, I am a brother, hey, you're one of the greatest actors. Yeah, yeah. That's your opinion. Yes, yes. It doesn't get to your, your head. Really. No, no, it's not my reality. Mm. My reality is I know where I'm falling short. Yes, yes. So, in order to be able to tell myself something good, I've got to look at where I'm falling short and perfect that mm -hmm. and tell myself, you nailed that one day. Yeah. yeah. So, you've got to learn, one has got to learn to be a better judge of themselves. Mm -hmm. And that way, you are not in competition with other people, you are in competition with yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, and most of the time, what the problem that we have, we are busy trying to compete with other people. With other people yeah. Here's a lovely thing. You hear young people say, you know, I'm still working on my brand. You know, I'm still working on my brand. <laughs> I'm still working on my brand. Your brand was made long before you even knew mm -hmm. that you had a brand. Mm -hmm. The moment your father's sperm mm -hmm. meet with your mother's egg, that's when that bond, that brand is formed. It's formed. So when are you are born in now with you don't you're not believing. And when are you think you are when I know you think you're still trying to work on your brand. Yeah. Your brand was formed long. Mm. And you know how you see that your brand was formed long before you knew it? When I know I mean, when you go to in fact here's one also what is nice. These days that when you're born. You come with an ID number. And you know what you know what is happening with that? Basically, with every child that is born, is identity. SARS. <laughs> SARS knows when to anticipate a certain you know yeah, money coming yeah, its yeah, way. Yeah. You know, it counts the years. Yeah. <laughs> It, and it, that's how they make this it. Age. By this age, yeah. it's Ali Seben Zele, so tell us something. <laughs> <laughs> so you come already with an ID number and it is yours. Mm. So that, that in itself mm. tells you, you are a brand. Yes. <laughs> you are a gecko fan now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Things that they trust now, mm. Mm. it is your ID number. And you know what? This. Because you get to a certain age now, when you get to get your ID mm, mm, mm. card, then what do they do? Shai is too. We used to call them a piano. Exactly. But shai a piano. I'm a piano of fun now. I'm a piano of fun now. Now, exactly. Now, let's look at how I'm a piano. I, what is that? No, I look at it, but la. Okay. You know, when you're doing fingerprints yeah. or biometrics, yes, we, we, yes, we, yes, we, so we, yeah, we we're used to in today's life, you know, comments. when you do the biometrics. Yeah. Okay. Now, it is because these lines here, mm. yours are drawn not like any other. Mm. Even twins mm. don't have the same fingerprints. They may be looking identical, but they don't have the same, same fingerprints. Yeah, yeah. So you realize, you should be realizing that your brand, it is made out of this fine print. Yeah, that's true. So now, how do you bring out, Ole, this fine print mm. is made out of this? Mm. Because with what I'm doing, with what you say, you think you know and understand that I'm doing. Mm. I'm saying, this is the makeup of this fine print. Yes, 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 yes. Mm. So instead of working on the brand that is something obscure almost, yeah. it is doing things that define the brand. Exactly, who we are. If I choose to be a serial killer, yeah. I will be choosing how you're going to, how this brand 
is going to be yeah. defined. Which branding a soul. Exactly. Yabula. Yabula. Yeah. And but you can buy money deal Life is easy, my job. But that's it, that's that. Mm. That's so that's it. Um the, the how we are so unique at happy days. Mm -hmm. We don't talk um, the things that are obvious. Yeah, you know, mm -hmm. we try to look and research mm -hmm. and do our own um, a bit of research. You know, to talk about okay. something that are exclusive. Okay. So um, I don't want to dwell much into your acting career, into your right. television, your generation, That's just it, like yes. other podcasters mm -hmm. do. What uh, I want to talk about, I want to talk about something different. Mm -hmm. You know. Excuse me. Uh, I want to talk about um, what you. The, the, like life here, mm -hmm. besides the acting part, right? You know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So um, uh, right now, I wanna look at. Uh, uh, if I'm sure you'll remember when I would say to you, um, lose to love. Lose to love. Yeah. I'm sure yes. Something will just trigger. You know, <laughs> okay. Uh, in your brain. Okay. You know? All right. Talk. Um, I'm talking. I'm now. I'm dwelling. In, like I said, that I wanna come back to. Yeah. Uh, Pell. Yes, you, that's it. You know? Yes. So um, I understand. So I wanted to, to for you to clarify clearly mm -hmm. what happened to your previous relationships um, for the fact that was spelled to love that song lose to love. Mm -hmm. You know what happened to the previously? What did you lose? Why I, I, I was talking to somebody and he defined he defined uh, I think relationships or getting into a relationship as playing Lord. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I just cut my chance. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Getting into a relationship, bro, yeah, it's yeah, like you'll never know. It's like playing low, yeah. You know what I mean? And and I think, you know, and I think that is such a, I mean, such a perfect and analogy mm. of what relationships are, okay. because you are constant like breaking. Love is a gamble. You are constantly gambling and hoping that you will get it, you know, or, or, you know, also pop. Also pop, yeah. <laughs> you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. That's what it is. Mm. You know, and I think finally... So you took your own gamble, a few Ah, bro, a boy, to, and a, a gambler will tell you <laughs> <laughs> they know of their losses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know? And they don't know where to stop. <laughs> and when to stop. <laughs> the only time they, they will stop is actually maybe even sometimes when they are turning in. Yeah. But... I think, and, and how do you get, like, for me, that is such a perfect analogy to use even mm. for love, for life. In, in general. In yeah. general. Yeah. Life is just a constant gamble. Yeah. You know, when you don't... So, it's really like, we have a bump at time. Yeah. Before Paul. Before Paul. But sometimes, you know, like, because also, because Lok Popa Lugu is actually dependent on yourself. Yes. Yes. You know? Yes. One of the things, it, yeah. exactly, one of the things that I say is that um, my past experiences mm. gave me lessons to be able to deal with my present. Mm. 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 You know, and when I deal with my present, I no longer deal with it with some sense of desperation. Mm. And sometimes I think when we are in relationship and things hit us, you know, we and we haven't... Uh, but again, being prepared to deal with it. Mm. One of the things that I say is that when you are born, here's what the, what happens. You know, you go to an age school going age, mm. and once you start going uh, to a school going age, uh, you go from grade one to grade twelve. Yeah. And you're going to spend these twelve years being prepared how to fit into. You know, to fit to fit in as a cog yes, in the yes, economic yes, machine. Yes, you know what I mean. Yeah, that's what you've been. You you do your twelve years there. After that, maybe you decide you're going to do you're going a degree to, yeah. or a diploma and whatever, and you're just being shaped for nothing else but to fit into the economy. Into the, into the economic machine, mm -hmm. and once you've done all that, you reach a, you are at that age where you think, oh, now I think I want to be a husband or be a wife. Mm, mm, mm. You may have gone there and now you're an accountant, even, a, what is it called? Chartered accountant. Mm, mm. You are a doctor. If somebody comes with a problem that has to do with accounting or the medicine, whatever, 
you'll give them the solutions. Mm. And now you go into marriage. And marriage is one, as, is one thing that you do, that you get a certificate before you complete it. Yes. Yeah. I need <laughs> All the other things. Yeah. In order for you to get your matric yeah. certificate, yeah. you had to learn. <laughs> That's and then you get given, yeah. and then marriage. Yeah. They give Very you fast. certificate up front. <laughs> <laughs> and then now you start to And then now you are going to le- try to learn how hey, to yeah, be yeah, married yeah, yeah, yeah. while you're already hey, in it. Nobody in puts in you to be an accountant inside accounting. In. So one thing that we have to find a way of creating a balance is how we raise people in order to be able to deal with conflict even as they go. Yes. And uh, when you look at our, for instance, let's say from one even to seven, or even one up until whatever age, M- maybe let's take it one to seven. Mm. At that time, you are taught that either when you're doing something wrong, you get beaten for it, mm. you know, or if not so, in order to get whatever you want, you throw a tantrum. Mm. <laughs> Do you see what I mean? Yeah. And you you never taught that everything in life you negotiate yourself around it. Yes. Okay. You know what I mean? Mm. So and we don't you don't even know or haven't learned how to deal with conflict. Mm. You see what I mean? Mm. So that is one thing that really somehow in life we've got to start really look, I mean, looking at them. Mm. You know what I mean? And now, but now, that's why I say my life experience taught me, gave me things, like now when I deal with problem or with even whatever we have with my partner, you know, is that I deal with that knowing what I don't have to be desperate Mm. to find a solution. But also I have learned that, you know, I say this also with actors or when you train actors, that you can never make an actor between breakfast and lunch. Mm. It takes a lifetime. Mm. You know, whatever you do in life, you actually must it after you've spent hours and hours. hours yeah. You know, I mean, I was looking at Jacob. I love uh, Djokovic. I mean, though I, I used, I hated him first because I used to love uh, <laughs> okay. Roger. You yeah. know what I yeah. mean? And Roger was age, he was catching up. But you look at that boy, mm. and basically that tells you how much hours he puts in order to be able to yeah. master yeah. His, craft. his craft. And you know, sometimes we tend to think, holy, Take things will cards. come from, mm. you know, uh, the Holy Spirit. Mm. No. Yeah. No, no, no. You have to work. Holy Spirit. Do, 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 do. Uh, yeah. Bankula, do. Do be something. Oh, Benjamin. Benjamin. Do. Benjamin. Do. 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 Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? So we, 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 we got to, you know, and that basically, you know, gave me that, mm-hmm. you know, uh, mm-hmm. that experience. But also, it is love, like I said earlier on, is caring in action. Mm-hmm. And but also you have to have a very good sense of who you are as a person. Mm-hmm. You know, and most of the time, you know, if somebody asked the question, Hori, if ever you were to date somebody, would you date yourself? Hmm. <laughs> first time I hear that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. And other people so date are very, yourself ex- first. Are you capable? I mean, are you the person that you would date? Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. You know, are you yeah. the person? If ever you were to date somebody, mm. would you be the person that you would date? Date, yeah. And many of us... We can't because we haven't dealt with ourselves. Mm. But so I think what I'm trying to say is like knowing oneself and coming to the point of really loving oneself. Mm. Mm. You cannot give what you don't have. Mm. 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 If you love yourself, if you know yourself and have a very thorough understanding of who you are, then you are able to judge yourself against the other mm, mm. and then you see who the other is and if that other is not aware of his otherness mm. and making sure Hore, he's got to or she's got to try and blend their otherness mm. with your other then there's, then there's a problem and you've got to teach yourself to identify that 
well and good time. Mm. Love is caring in action. Mm. The moment I knew that it mattered mm. how she felt, I knew that I, I care. I yeah. love her. So, but then it was by default because now, apparently, by uh, menyum exactly. So you, you see now, if it, something meant to happen, mm -hmm. it will happen. It it will happen, and it, but you, you know, like there are certain I things. Yeah, so yeah, zim kumbini, and then zia kula. And I mean, some '90s, you mm -hmm. know, say it's a thought like, you know, it's a cool, it's a thought like, and then. Because I come out, man, talk the current day, but what is the key, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. And at that time, at that time, you know, be careful, you know, be yeah, careful yeah. because in the summer flop, we had appointments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A yeah, couple yeah, of yeah. times, and, and, yeah, yeah and, 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 I, and I didn't turn up. Mm. So at that time, in fact, we must learn how to win a age. So in the show, in the la, 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 in that's you know, <laughs> so but anyway, I just said, hey, I'll tell him we're wrong. Oh, you stood there up a couple of times for meetings yeah, and cancelled yeah, right yeah, at the yeah. end. So, yeah, yeah, Tula, <laughs> Chila, yeah, but you know, you know, walk, you you know. Paid off. and then oh. you know, and then we went, and then you know, Zakok, uh, you know, you know, in fact, we own Kitty. <laughs> I will say, but she doesn't like it. <laughs> but we don't get it. <laughs> get you know what? Is, this one thing that you know, women give you permission. Yeah. To talk to them. Okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, they will give, and, and they will give you permission to say, "Come into my." Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And uh, and that is why I say, you know, sometimes as guys, we really it's like got to teach. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, and now when you go in, and if at, let's suppose you decide to go in mm -hmm. into that relationship, mm -hmm. you've got to be clear. Yeah, you know, and uh, and another thing is we got to you know, we they just said I'm not, I'm not really like ardently a Christian or mm -hmm. zealously mm -hmm. Christian. They said we are created in the image of God. Mm -hmm. Now, if we are created in the image of God, it means some way, somehow we have to carry ourselves godly. Yeah. And we've got to mm. realize that in us, we actually possess or carry with, or we carry with us a godly mm. element. So you need to represent. And you need to represent it well. Mm. And you know where we have a very godly element? Mm. It's in our sperms. Oh, okay. Yes. I'm challenged. In a godly situation. Because in your sperm, all your who you are mm. can be recreated. Or you recreate in your own image. Mm. Mm. You see that? So one thing that we never realize and we don't recognize is that when we go into that space, mm, to create a, we are yes, going yes. into a godly space. Mm, mm. We are going to where even marriage happens. Yes. People talk about, we think this is marriage. This is not marriage. Yeah, yeah. Marriage. This yeah, is not marriage. Just, just this is a ceremony. Yeah. Marriage happens. When the sperm meets with the egg, mm, mm, mm. give you an example. I, I told you earlier on about my eldest son who passed yes, on. Yes, 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 yes. Now I've got other five children, okay. with five different women. Mm. I'm not married to their mothers, yeah, but I'm tied to them. Mm. Lebona, yes, yes, they are tied to me. Mm. But do you realize again when I say, and now, when I look at that whole aspect, it, I always say, man, Jesus, I would tell you, you are f up. 
yeah. really you are. Mm. Because how do you do that? But the thing is, I was never taught that. Mm. And that is one thing that every child has got to be made to realize. Mm. That as you're growing up, as you are, there is a God self that you are carrying with you. Mm. And when you decide to go and share that God self, Make sure that you share that God self with somebody that you will live through your life yes, with that yes. God self. You need to be sure. But yeah. again, is that you have got to be, but again, having gone through the right preparation. Mm. Mm. Look mm. at what happens when you've learned to be a doctor, when you've learned to be a, an accountant, you actually even end up going out of working, being retired by yeah. that. Yeah, 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 that's true. What is it that will retire you as a human being? Mm -hmm. You retire out of your humanness by death. Mm. Yeah. Of being that father from the moment you started. Mm. And from the moment you die. You die. That is your retirement. Oh, no. Say it mouthful. You know. So those are the things that we actually have got to start really, really looking. I mm. wish I had somebody when I was young, mm. you know, mm. but again young and virile <laughs> you know <laughs> exactly yeah. and maybe he just gave me that lesson that hey, hey when you go when yeah. you go there i know it is nice mm. and we are hey, but pay in mind or and i don't know there is measures that can be taken mm. Mm. you know what i mean mm. Bruna, actually when we were growing up i mean Condom was like yeah, yeah, yeah. it was never our in our vocabulary. Yeah, you know. Though my mother taught me about it, mm. but I mm. like, uh, uh, yeah, uh, uh, you know. Mm. And my mother, you know, when he spoke to me about it, I was fourteen years old. Mm. You know, he then they called, and Yena she was actually saying, yeah. <laughs> you, know, yeah. you know, you know, and 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 Bona, they used to call it French leather. Mm. Yeah, the very first condoms. You know how they were made, and I think it was discovered by a French whatever scientist or whatever. Mm, I don't even know. Yeah, <laughs> the very first condom was made out of I think the skin. Some I don't know, but from a cow skin. Mm. I don't know whether some malag untengil. You know, and then they used to call it because it was done. It was discovered by a French guy. It was called French leather. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. So and that was used to what we say as a condom. Mm. You know what I mean? So that is what I'm telling you. So, and another thing, Majita, you have baby mama drama. You know, and Mauva Nimbi baby mama drama, I end up with some phone, I end up with some phone, I end up with some phone, I end up with some phone. Yeah, I'm clear now. But are you, are, you, are you clear in your head? Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because um shen um duan. But and here's another thing that happens that we are not being cognizant of. When you pregnant a woman, you undergo no changes whatsoever. Mm. The woman is going to body is going to change. When ushala u ngalendlelunga kwa. And then here's another thing, food. When that child is born. In fact, from the moment of conception, mm. she lives with your reality. Day in, day out, the moment she becomes aware, mm -hmm. and now she's pregnant, she lives with your reality inside her. Good guys. This is Every day of her life, until the child is born, mm. she lives with the reality of your existence in her life. Mm. And the child is born. She's going to be suckling Part of your reality lives with it mm. day in, day out. Mm. We never look at it that way. Yeah. You know what I mean? And baby even is my looking down, look cooler. He actually even begins to see you in there. Nice. And by that time when you know what I mean? Mm. And also on top of that, she has undergone, you know, physical changes. You know, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. 
Come put sort it, put sort. Yeah. Put on the sort. You know. And then manje, I will. And then now, who do you expect with Fanam Tan? Men, That's like I say, my bro, men, we've got to really begin to think no, these things yeah, yeah. very, very, very carefully. Yeah. And when we go into those spaces, really think yourself, about, but am I prepared mm. for what comes mm. with this? Mm. You know what I mean? There's got to be a process of raising men or reawakening, because also the reawakening is important. Mm. Mm. Because we can't just say, Horna, you've got to teach the young ones and you don't make the reawakening. Because at the moment in the reawakening, we actually have got to start, you know, working, putting things, you know, right. Right, yeah. You know, so that you can actually be able to teach right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very interesting discussion, Dasilo. Thank you, I had today with you and I'm very happy to have you on Happy Days on podcast. And uh, I know that uh, the Nothing But The Truth uh, at uh, the Santin Santin, Convention. yes. Nothing uh, But The Truth. From the 28th until the 15th. Until the 16th. So it's 28th um, March, March to yeah. the 16th. Yeah, and uh, tickets, tickets are flying out. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't yeah. miss out. Yeah, don't miss out. And uh, if you think you've seen me, you see me killing it on television. You yeah, haven't yeah, seen yeah. me <laughs> killing it. On yeah, stage. I would definitely be there. And uh, on stage, just know that my performance is not manufactured by yeah. the editors. Yeah, yeah. On stage, you see it. Nine, nine. Nine, nine. <laughs> I'm, you, I'm going raw yes. on you. <laughs> I just wanted to say, um, I mean, man, um, stay humble. Thank you, my brother. The way you are. Thank I've you. known you a um, long time ago. You remember the early days of Joseph M. Yes. I used to jump across the street. In the I, I know. Yeah, I know. I love it too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, thank you, So it is brother. very nice to still have you these years after so many years. Reggie, thank you. Man. And then thanks to Sis Pell yeah. for answering my call. I've yeah. been very, very much persistent. <laughs> No, man, this is pale, man. I mean, I'm pale. Yeah. I'm a medium. Yeah, yeah. Ah, but I'm a shino. Yeah, but I'm a shino. I'm a man. And I'm a man. Yeah, I'm a man. Water is life. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a man. So, yeah. I'm a man. 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 So it's happy days. It's been very nice. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Reggie. Thank you, man. Thank you for the opportunity, my brother. Thank you.